guys, it's Tom from CT Tutorials. Today I'm going to be showing you how to change your icon of any program on the Mac OS X. As you can see, I changed some icons Finder, Safari, iChat. So, yeah, what we're going to change is iTunes. Changing the icons, the same concept for any program, all programs apply, same thing. So now what we're going to start off by doing is go to Finder, Applications, then whatever application you're doing. But for this, it's going to be iTunes. You're going to um, right click and you're going to go Show Package Contents. On the very bottom, it should be Resources. And after you've done that, you're going to want to look for the original iTunes icon. As you can see, the file is going to be called iTunes.ICNS. What you're going to do is change the, um, the word to whatever you want. I recommend just putting a 2 at the end. Now you you're gonna need a dot i c n s file of whatever you're replacing. So I have my dot i c n s file already in this the resources. Now what you're gonna do is just put it in and just do iTunes, just like uh, that. So then after you've done that, you can go ahead and x out of all this. Then go to Finder, or no, I should say, go to the Apple logo, force quit, and they can just go ahead and relaunch Finder. Open up iTunes. As you can see, the icon has changed. Now, before it's going to change on your dock, you're just going to need to update it to so Applications. Except that, and just go to iTunes again. Go ahead and make that go away, and just drag and drop back to same original spot. And there we go. We have just changed the iTunes icon. If you're wondering, does this remove any of my files? Does it change anything? No. All you're doing is just replacing the icon with some other icon. Um, so that's pretty much it, so, yeah, just subscribe, comment, rate, and I'll see you guys later, thanks for watching.